Marvel Super Heroes Mavuru Su Pahai Ro Zu Mavuru Super Heroes is a fighting video game developed by Capcom. Originally released in the arcade in 1995 on the CPS2 arcade system, it was ported to the Sega Saturn and PlayStation in late 1997. The game, alongside Marvel vs. Capcom, Clash of Super Heroes, was also included in the Marvel vs. Capcom Origins Collection, released digitally for the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 in September 2012. Marvel Super Heroes is loosely based on the Infinity Gauntlet storyline of the Marvel Universe. It is the second Capcom fighting game based on characters from the Marvel Comics line, following X-Men, Children of the Atom, and was later succeeded by the Marvel vs. Capcom series. This game was dedicated to the memory of Jack Kirby, with character artwork based on his old designs. Gameplay Marvel Super Heroes is a fighting game in which superheroes and villains from the Marvel Universe fight against each other. The aim of the game is to use attacks and special abilities to knock out the opponent, or possess more life than him, her at the end of the round. Throughout the match, players build up a super meter which can be used to perform powerful infinity combo attacks. A unique mechanic in the game are the infinity gems, power, time, space, reality, soul and mind. These gems can be earned by obtaining them from opponents during arcade mode, or by fulfilling certain criteria during versus mode, such as getting the first hit. By using these gems in battle, fighters receive enhanced effects for a short amount of time, such as increased power or defense, health recovery or additional attacks. Certain fighters will receive extra benefits whilst using certain gems. For example, if Spider-Man uses the Power Gem, he can create a doppelganger on the opposite side of his opponent for extra damage during his attacks. Plot Loosely based on the Infinity Gauntlet storyline, the game focuses on heroes and villains battling each other for the Infinity Gems. The main antagonist is Thanos, who plots to use the Infinity Gems to take over the universe. Topic: Fighters. Anatab, Blackheart, Captain America, Doctor Duma, The Incredible Hulk, Iron Man, Juggernaut, Magneto, Psylocke. Shuma Gorath, Spider Man, Thanosa, Wolverine Notes, Carrot A Unlockable Boss Character, Carrot B Hidden Character in Original Japanese Version and Unlockable in Origins Port. Development Capcom included the four characters from X-Men, Children of the Atom which their market research had determined to be the most popular, Wolverine, Juggernaut, Magneto and Psylocke. The home conversions of the game were unveiled on the first day of the 1996 Electronic Entertainment Expo, with Stan Lee appearing at the booth. The Saturn version supports the 1 MB RAM expansion cartridge to include extra frames of animation and slightly quicker load times. Reception The arcade version received positive reviews. Computer and Video Games awarded it a full 5 fifths rating. Despite scoring it only 3 out of 5 stars, Next Generation gave it a relentlessly positive review, saying it, "...blends loads of combo-powered attacks with liquid smooth animation to contend with some of the best fighters out there." They were also pleased with the selection of Marvel characters and the 2D graphics, saying they make a «refreshing» change from the polygon-based fighters that by this time were dominating the fighting games market. Wizard opined that «with great graphics, challenging gameplay and plenty of moves, throws and counters, Marvel Super Heroes has much to offer». Awarding it a 95%, Rich Ledbetter of Sega Saturn magazine praised the Saturn conversion for retaining all the scenery effects of the arcade version, and commented that, "...Marvel Super Heroes makes 2D graphics cool again." In 2013, Marvel Super Heroes ranked as the 16th best Marvel video game by Geek magazine for its, 
chaotic, yet insanely fun, gameplay. That same year, Rich Knight and Gus Turner of Complex included it on their list of 25 best 2D fighting games of all time, stating that the gem collecting mechanic was a big difference maker for the title and, as a result, the game still feels fresh today. See also Marvel Super Heroes – War of the Gems, a side-scrolling action game produced by Capcom for the Super NES. Marvel vs. Capcom – Infinite, another Capcom fighting game focusing on the Infinity Gems.